717, and tonight, KHON2 will debut a special 30 minute program featuring four revered and respected kupuna. It's called Ike Kupuna, and Kathy Muneno and I had the opportunity to sit down with the four people being featured tonight. Kathy joins us now live to help us preview the show. Good morning, Kathy. Nice seeing you. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Now, before we talk about who will be on the show, let's talk about Ike Kupuna and what the show means. Okay, well, this show, it, what it does is it allows us the time to delve into the lives and the wisdom of these kupuna who've contributed so much to our community for decades, and they still contribute. And these four who we're featuring tonight they are from very different professions. So we have very different perspectives and we can see the breadth of what just these four have given to our community. And one of the four who will be featured tonight, Dave Shoji, former Rainbow Wahine volleyball coach. He invited me into his home where he talked about what he's been up to since retirement, what he misses about coaching and what he doesn't, as well as the legacy he's known for. Yeah, I never envisioned the kind of following we eventually had. Not only at the arena, but, you know, TV brought out many, many more fans. I used to have people tell me that, hey, my grandmother, she can't wait till the game starts and everything has to stop. Everybody has to watch. And so that really made me feel part of the community and how much we were doing for the community. There's much more of his interview tonight, as well as the story of Stuart Ho right there, a former Honolulu businessman who's part of a family dynasty. And I'm going to be featuring two kupuna, one being the country doctor. He served the North Shore community for 50 years, and he's so beloved that he was made a Samoan chief on the North Shore. And then in our next hour, I'll be showing you a clip of an interview I did with Kumuhula May Kamamalu Klein. Now, she has a big concern about the next hundred years of hula and where it's going. And I tell you what, Kathy, I had a lot of fun interviewing uh, Stuart Ho as well as Dave Shoji. And one of the hardest parts is that they have so much to share, so many good stories. It's hard to cut it down in just a small piece. <laughs> You're telling me, I think my Kumuhula May Klein interview was about three hours and, <laughs> you know, six minutes of our time or five minutes. But, um, but yeah, that was really hard. But I do have to tell our viewers, too, I saw your Dave Shoji um, story and there was some laughing out loud <laughs> uh, in your story. It's so fun to see him. Um, outside of volleyball. And I gotta say, he kept on saying, you sure this isn't for a longer piece? It's only five minutes. How long is this piece again? Because I kept asking questions because he's so interesting <laughs> to talk to as well as Stuart Ho and the people you talk to as well. And we'll hear more yeah. about the people you're featuring in our next hour. Yes, thank you. Thanks, right. Christine. We'll see you in our next hour. Thanks, Kathy. Okay.